I have a new item to show you today. These are Chef squeeze bottles and um, they come in different sets. This is the multi-pack of different sizes. It has the 16 ounce, the 12 ounce, and the 6 ounce. But you can also buy the set of three with all of the same. So if you want all three to be 16 or all three to be 12 or all three to be six you can do that as well uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at them here's a close-up of the 16 ounce there is um, markings on the side so that if uh, if that's important to you that's nice that that has that uh, I like that it's clear so you can see through it and um, the plastic on it, as far as squeezing it, is nice and comfortable and flexible, uh, but at the same time it seems sturdy so it's not too flimsy. Um, when you take the top off, it actually has two pieces here. So let me take that off. Uh, here, you can see that it's uh, fairly wide mouth. It's not like, I, if I had a choice I'd actually prefer it to be even wider along the top, but it's definitely not a typical squeeze bottle that has a much smaller opening. So it's wide enough that it's good for the uses for most people of if you want to put in thicker sauces like um, mustards and ketchups and barbecue sauces and things like that you would not be hard to fill, refill this and it's not going to be too hard to keep it clean. So the top, you put that on and then this goes on top where you, you squeeze it down. Uh, the main feature also that I think is a, a big selling point for this for myself and a lot of other people is um, is this top. The top and the top, the thing that uh, caps it, as opposed to being one of those little red caps that fits on. This is built in, and I like that it's just so easy. And that is probably, for me, the biggest uh, reason why I got it. The other is because it has the wider opening. It's not super wide, but uh, it, it'll work for me. And then the, the little opening at the top, Let's see if I can see that. It's um, small, so that's good, but not so small that you couldn't use this for salad dressings where you have different herbs in there. That could definitely not have a problem with that. Uh, if it was too small, you wouldn't be able to use it for anything that had any kind of chunky stuff in it. Um, now, these are not completely leak-proof and they are not completely airtight only on this part here. They're leak proof here uh, which a lot of the other bottles leak along here. They're leak proof here but here if you tip it or if it's like that you're gonna have some dribbling coming out of it and let me show you right now like here if you're doing like that let's see here let's see if we can get that so this this is nice that it has the top and that it's built in but as I said oops, but as I said leak proof here but it will dripple out a little bit here Let's see. but not uh, a disaster if it tips over so it's not something that you would be able to take and have rolling around in your lunch bag <laughs> But uh, as long as you keep it upright, that's fine. Um, a lot of people seem to really like this a lot. It gets really good reviews. And um, I'm very happy with it. I'm going to try it with a couple of things. I'm going to try it out on some mustard. And I didn't put a whole lot of mustard in here. But just, just to show you how it can squirt out. And it's a nice fine, see, you can control it. You could even use this for plating if you want to make something to make your um, your food look fancy. Uh, but it comes out good. I'm going to try this on some mayo. 
So mayo is definitely a lot thicker than the mustard. So let's try that here and, and pouring it out. See how you get a nice good stream on that. I didn't put a whole lot of mayo in here, so it's kind of like, ah, it's kind of getting to the end. Um, a lot of your, your, a lot of your mustard, ketchup, mayos, a lot of these come in squeeze bottles from the store. Uh, the reason why I would use this is I want to make my own homemade mustard, ketchup, mayo, barbecue sauce, salad dressings. So that's really what I got this, um, this set for is to make my own stuff um, or if I end up with a store-bought item and it doesn't come in a squeeze bottle then I can transfer it to there but um, that would be the other situation I'd use it for. Uh, this would be good for oils. Um, definitely good for that because if you have an oil and it's sitting out on the counter then this t cap is going to be very useful to keep out any kind of dust and if it does tip over it's not a major disaster it'll dripple out like a little bit but but not a whole lot uh so you're not making a, ma a big mess um so um that's pretty much it for my review um i'm very happy with it um and just keep in mind that this is not totally airtight. That's the first thing. And it's not totally leak proof at this part here. But this part's great. The bottle's great. And uh, I definitely am happy that I got them. So uh, that's it for my review. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye.